This is Oyutolga. Oyutolga includes a series of high-grade deposits. Since 2012, we have been mining the ore from just one of these, using open pit mining. Here, we dig the ore from the surface using excavators and massive 300-ton trucks to transport the ore for processing. But the best ore, up to 80% of the value of the project, lies deep below the surface. Preparations are underway to mine this ore using underground mining techniques. This is a hugely complex project. The total depth of the underground mine will be 1.3 kilometers, as deep as 12 blue sky towers stacked on top of each other. The total length of the tunnels will be 200 kilometers, equal to the distance from Ulaanbaatar to Darhan. The tunnels are wide enough to allow trucks to pass each other and have a height of 5.5 meters. There are many methods used to mine resources underground. One of them is block caving, which will be used at Oyutolga. This method is used at mines with large metallic ore that can be easily broken up. Block caving means that the material will be mined by collapsing the ore body from below. To do this, lateral tunnels are dug under the ore body. This is called the undercut level. Explosives are detonated under the ore body and it starts to collapse. The ore falls through the draw bells to the draw points from where it is transported by trucks to the crusher. As ore is taken from the draw points, more ore falls down. The flow of ore continues under the force of gravity. Block caving costs less than other mining methods because, apart from the initial phase, it relies on gravity and not expensive blasting. This will make Oyutoga's underground mining highly efficient. Even more important, block caving is considered safer than other methods used for underground mining. Just like everything that we do at Oyutolga, safety is paramount when working underground. The mine walls are reinforced with concrete to prevent collapse and everyone working underground will be highly trained and wear protective equipment at all times. One of the most important facilities constructed underground is the refuge chamber where workers will be safe in an emergency. Twenty other facilities will be built deep underground. Some of these will process the ore, crushing it further and conveying it to the surface. Other facilities will be used to maintain machinery, provide fuel and ensure that everything is in place to allow mining to continue uninterrupted. The whole construction is expected to take approximately five to seven years and will increase the amount of concentrate containing saleable metals we produce significantly. With underground mining ramped up to full production, OT will produce approximately 1.8 million tons of concentrate annually, compared to 700,000 tons today. As we progress towards the development of the first large-scale underground mine in Mongolia, Oyutolga continues to develop its people, creating enduring value, knowledge and skill. The mission in our heart when we go to work each morning is to combine our efforts to deliver a long-term, safe and globally competitive business that contributes to the prosperity of Mongolia. <laughs>